Hey, good day everyone. How are you guys? Um, start of a new week. Um, we got one uh, one camel with uh, vaginal prolapse. Okay. The, what happened was the camel um, gave birth to a, uh, of course, a camel calf. And afterwards, the vagina didn't return to its proper place. So, we got this one right here. See, there it is. And we have the baby. Okay, so first things first, you have to uh, remember to uh, restrain the camel. So, as you can see, so if you don't know how to do it, refer back to my previous videos on how to restrain a camel. So what we're gonna do is uh, tie both legs in front and uh, of course the rear legs. And uh, once that's done, then we can proceed with the procedure of uh, um, making a uh, box suture um, towards the vulva. But of course we'll uh, clean it first. Um, we will be needing uh, lubricant gel, um, povidone in uh, wa dissolved in water, and then uh, we're gonna need uh, suture and uh, this um, um, needle to puncture the the side of the bulb. And then we'll give it uh, anti-inflammatory and um, um, one uh, intramuscular antibiotic, which is uh, broad spectrum. So just to uh, prevent the infection. So now we are. My assistant is preparing our uh, things, and uh, the farmer they are uh, uh, having the animal ready, restrained, so they know how to do it. Like I said, refer to my previous video. I'll uh, link the description below so that you know how to do it. Let's uh, let's help the farmers. Let's help my assistant so that we can uh, proceed with the. Uh, um, suturing of the vagina let's go all right guys so just to have a second look of uh, that uh, um, prolapse there it is so it's uh, it's been dos kit kit dos kit na din kit na din das din asharayom asharayom all right so this has been out for four days according to the farmers so it's been four days okay so just for you to have a look there it is so this is my hand that's how big it is all right let's do it tal awal habil ruben Takalas, tal sa musada. Ayaw, tal, 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 tal. Ayaw, kalas. Irbut mas buta, hati, kalas. Nos, 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 pas, nos, 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 nos. Okay. Colors. Okay, first off, we need to clean it. Okay, those MC Katama, Rebel, okay. Those wide na farid, MC Kada. Do you see the size of that? Okay, guys. So you have to remember that this is a very. Minora kipkat. 
Okay, so uh, previously there was a suture done here by another uh, doctor, but this one's a weak uh, suture. So we have to do it again. Ah, rubel, rubel. So guys, remember this is a very delicate uh, organ. So uh, if not uh, if not properly done, it will uh, bleed. But uh, slight bleeding is okay. So we just need to uh, really be careful on uh, dealing with it. Hey, hey, poke, poke, poke. Hi, come on, come on, come on, come on, See, the animal is not uh, comfortable with this procedure. Carefully remove those cubs that are um, on top of the tissue. We don't want that inside when we return it. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. Okay, so we're done cleaning it. But uh, we're having problem with the restraint of the animal. So the animal is not uh, comfortable. Okay, so just for your information guys, we don't have any sedative uh, given to this uh, animal. No local anesthetic as well, so it's a it's bleeding a little bit, but that's fine. Um, okay, so we're ready to return it. I'm just gonna put my long gloves and we'll do that suturing. Ah, uh, Rubel, give gloves. Why oh, my walk up, huh? Okay, so we decided to give it uh, sedative after all, so the animal is not uh, settled, so we don't want uh, to do this procedure while the animal is struggling, so we're giving it uh, Silozine just to keep the animal calm. Dos, nakpakro? Okay. All right, so we need to, yeah, us. Okay, we'll just have to wait for uh, five minutes. Come sa digiga? Five minutes, then we'll let the animal settle first.
guys so uh, like I said we sedated the animal and uh, we couldn't do it without sedation so that's why uh, um, it's needed um, as you can see we did we did not do the box suture why because the prolapse is uh, big and it might uh, rupture again or it might by straining it might uh, you know return and it might uh, cut the suture so I did an interrupted one and uh, we're giving it uh, antibiotic and uh, anti-inflammatory and then we'll leave it for 14 weeks and I'll give you an update for 14 for 14 days sorry and I'll give you an update afterwards and we'll remove that suture okay so let's give it uh, um, the medicine and then I'll see you on the next farm Thank you.